Hello, people of YouTube. Hello, Silver Stackers. Hello, Coin Roll Hunters. Hello, everyone from Fourth Hand Media, and welcome to my little corner of the internet. This is Michael from Penny Haven, and first off, if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button, then give it a like, then come back over here and hit that bell icon so you know when my new videos come out. All right, so you might notice something a little different about my setup today. Uh, Mrs. Pennyhaven had to borrow my iPad, so I'm back to using, you know, the old school method of a week and a half ago, this old webcam. So, quality's not going to be what it has been recently. I apologize. Also, you might hear something in the background. That is little Pennyhaven, who promised me he can play quietly for two minutes. We'll see how that goes. Anyway, so today what I have for you is a little mail call. This mail call comes from my, my cousin Cam. He got a hold of me and he said, hey, I've got a few coins that have shown up in my pocket change. Would you have any interest in them? And he contacted me because he knew I was starting to get heavy into the coin collecting hobby again. And that's another thing I suggest is let people know. You never know who's got a coin collection or a few spare coins that they don't know what to do with. I've gotten both now. Someone sent me an entire 24 pound coin collection and people have given me just a, a couple of little coins here and there, which is wonderful. I love it. So the first thing he contacted me with was this, and I'll try to put some inserts in because this doesn't uh, autofocus. So it's got this really cool bust on the front, and it is uh, an armored bust of Vasco Nunez de Balboa. And on the front, it says undecimo de Balboa, that means it's one tenth of a Balboa. On the back, it says Republica de Panama, a Panamanian one tenth Balboa, with this really cool you know, conquistadorian looking uh, a helmeted gentleman on the front, Nunez de Balboa. So that was really cool. Uh, this next one, it took me a little bit to run down exactly what this one was. Because uh, uh, it ended up being a Thailand one bot. The reason I couldn't run it down at first is all of this profile is like straight on sideways and the other ones were about you know three quarters like that and what it ended up being is this is a more modern example and the other ones i've been seeing were from you know a couple decades ago so this is uh i think runs up into the teens you know just a few years ago they were still making that one but it's pretty cool i like it <laughs> you know you don't see any american currency that has uh, someone with glasses on it you don't really see that, do you? Even Roosevelt had his glasses off on the dime. Anyway, and the last thing he sent me, and I may have mentioned this a couple of times, I haven't done my big video on foreign currency yet, but what I'm really into right now is old UK stuff, Australian, Canadian. You know, call me an Anglophile, if you will, but uh, I love the, the royalty on front. And this is a George the Sixth uh, Canadian 10 cent piece. Canadian dime, if you will, and the profile is really great, and the age is great, so it's got this black tarnish, and it makes the letters just pop perfectly. It's wonderful looking, even though it's got this age, and the back is pretty, pretty worn and tarnished, but I love the look of the coin. These are 80% silver, whenever it goes back that, that late. This is a 1950 example, and so you're going to have this cool aging and tarnish, and I just love it. I don't need a, I do not need a... Uh, pristine 1950 dime. I'll take that. All right. So that's all I've got for you today. Um, once again, please hit that subscribe button. It should be right there. And keep coming back, watch my videos. Please like and subscribe if you haven't yet. I do. I know I always say this, but it's always true. I have a lot of great stuff coming up. So thank you, little Penny Haven. Can you say hi? Hi. He did real great. Thank you for watching. This is Michael from Penny Haven. Happy hunting.